video walkthrough today in this bright uh, South Carolina weather. It's very nice. Oh, that's bright. Yeah, it's very bright. Anyway, we got a 2019 Winnebago Sunstar 29BE. Uh, very nice. It has pretty low miles on it. I think it's around 17.5 or so. 17, yes, sir. Yeah, but it's one of my, uh, or I really like this floor plan and this model a lot. It has a lot of cool features. So starting here, it does have the side view cameras. It's very nice. I like the Trimark 4. Um, those are uh, easy to use and sturdy. Uh, moving along, it has two grab handles. So that makes it pretty convenient. Tons and tons of storage. Uh, look at these cargo bays. They go for days. So so are the doors themselves. <laughs> yeah, right? Uh, you also have uh, an inverter in here, uh, which is very convenient. Uh, that should do at least uh, some of the outlets and the TV. I don't know if it has a residential style refrigerator. We'll check that when we go in there. Um, it's got outdoor speakers for your little party pad. Uh, it does have the, the giant uh, awning with the party strip LED lights. Uh, I believe this can come out, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. There you go. Uh, put that back. Oh, this outdoor kitchen is phenomenal. Uh, I really like it. There's tons of storage, uh, prep areas. You got storage. Yeah, more storage. Uh, just tons of cool There's little There's another stuff. prep area too. Yeah? Yep. Uh, right here? Yep. Oh, sweet. Look at that. That's pretty cool. I like that. Don't forget the cooler too. Yep, I was about to get to that. Uh, the cooler with a little drain. And it's uh, it's got the little Winnebago brand on it. It's branded with the Winnebago. So that's pretty cool uh and then a nice little sli sliding cabinet right there i believe let me check there is or was maybe a propane quick neck somewhere uh i could be wrong no it doesn't nope. look like it I so charcoal it is then charcoal it is uh i bet if i do some more exploring there'll be uh a propane quick connect somewhere storage got some lights cool uh moving around to the back uh wait propane quick connect there it is there it is hot diggity dog very convenient so you can plug in your propane grill right there have it set up for your little outdoor kitchen here's access and vent for your furnace with a vent cover which is nice yes so you don't get the uh the bees and the bugs and all that stuff in there um yeah you got a nice size ladder you got a backup camera and you got tons and tons more storage down through here well that's the onan generator you got your electrical bay this is storage and it's uh it's pass through storage too uh which is pretty convenient uh here's your wet bay it's good size you got a water filter Sometimes when you're out there, sometimes uh, the campgrounds have questionable uh, water sources. <laughs> my water's a little tangy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> a little sulfury. Ooh, mm, yep. my favorite. Right? Uh, there we go. Uh, propane tank. Uh, that's pretty clean. You got your hydraulic fluid with the reservoir. Slot. Yep. Um, a good size propane tank. So. Oh moving along here it does have the super slide on it so it goes pretty much from the right behind the driver's seat the whole way to the back bedroom and we'll see that when we go in yep right here you got your awning control seat out oh yes my favorite part about awnings the weight yeah all right so we'll just leave it like that for a second. Uh, looks like he's got some water on it, so we'll let it dry. You got a good size uh, cockpit up there. We'll put the bed up really quickly so we can get a better look at that. It's nice and toasty in here. This furnace works pretty, pretty well. Yeah, a lot better than it being cold, you know? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So, yeah, good size. You can see it has the pilot seats, which is convenient. 
You got your fold out tray here for your Chick fil A. Um, we are not endorsed by Chick fil A. Just your favorite really, food group. We just really like it. Um, it's dangerous that there's a Chick fil A like less than a mile from the dealership. <laughs> It's always here. Well, I'm pretty sure we help keep them in business. We can go there in the morning, order there for lunch, and on the way home pick up dinner. Exactly. All three. Uh, over here you got your auto levelers set up, um, which is always convenient. You got your pull, pull blinds. You got your automatic, uh, where is it? I lost it. What is it? The levelers? Oh no, the, uh, it's right here. Push button nightshade. Wow, uh, you got heated mirrors too. Nice little cup holder. You got your big gulp. <laughs> Driving it. Uh, and then you can see just tons of storage. Nice cushion, comfy couch. Um, this is brand new OEM from Winnebago. When we got it a couple months ago. Um, there was no couch. There was no couch. <laughs> so we ordered a new one from Winnebago. Um, but it pulls out very nice. This also turns into a bed. I do have to say all of this is very clean and well taken care of. Um, it, it looks pretty much brand new in here still. So moving back to the control panel, you can see you have the, uh, the Euroloft bed light or bed lift, if I could talk today. So you just press that and it comes down smooth. You see you got more storage back there. You got a little net for the kiddos. Uh, That's does. important. Yes. Oh, it, but it does. Um, especially when they get into that WWE wrestling. We got four kids, so it could be dangerous up there. <laughs> uh, right here's the ladder. It has easy storage for the ladder, which is great. Yeah, here's your uh, inverter, which, nope, it has the regular, um, regular refrigerator or, you know, the standard uh, propane refrigerator. The dual, dual source uh, fridge. Yep. Yep. So I'm guessing the inverter probably goes to the TV. Um, you got your tank heaters for winter camping, uh, your test levels, uh, your water pump, your generator on and off, your thermostat, some lights, and here's your slide button. Uh, but I do want to direct it back to this counter space. Oh, it's a nice little trim piece. I'll have to get the guys at the shop to reinstall that. Yeah, when they find out where the trim piece goes. Yeah. Uh, that's actually a good question. I don't see any trim pieces missing. I Mystery. think it's down oh, yeah. here. I see it. Yeah, it's along the cabinet. So, um, we got uh, a nice microwave. You got your suburban stove with a nice little oven. Tons of storage space. Again, I really like these countertops. You got the lift away uh, sprayer nozzle, dual sinks, convenient. Uh, yeah, your owner's manual bags. Uh, yep, here's your refrigerator. Here's your little pantry. You can keep all your spices, whatever you need to in there. Uh, a giant wardrobe in the back. Uh, oh, here's that for uh, up there. The it's little your, table? Yeah, for the pilot seats. Um, yep, more, more wardrobe. See tons and tons of drawers. You got your TV, which lifts up. More storage back there. Uh, you got your little vanity thing here too. You could sit here and put a mirror up and do your makeup. Well, Get all pretty. Yep, not me, but my wife would, you know. Uh, you got some more wardrobes over here. Uh, these cubbies are pretty cool and convenient. It's got outlets in here for your charging. Uh, more drawers, and of course, more storage up here. So you got storage for days. Nice. This thing is, is amazing if you're a couple or a family or something in between. I don't know. Um, bunch it, of friends it, going on a road trip. Bunch of friends going on a road trip. You're going to tailgate a Penn State game. Uh, <laughs> or a Browns or Bengals game. Yeah, well, I feel bad for those people. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, so it, it's a really great little RV. Super low miles. Uh, tons of awesome features just set up really thoughtfully tons of space. Did we show them the bathroom yet? No Let's do that really quick and we'll uh, wrap up the little four. Yeah, there you go. Let's get some lights on um, Close that uh, But that's very spacious as well, too. You got tons and tons of space You got that you got your medicine cabinet uh, 
The shower is great. Actually has tons of headroom for for the taller people. Oh yeah, that's yeah. always great. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, one of the things you know you don't realize it, but RVs aren't necessarily designed for six foot three people or, or taller. So we get that a lot. Um, a shorter guy like me, like five eight, I never had to think about that before. <laughs> it all fit perfectly. So. Anyway, uh, it does have extra space in case you are a little taller and um, you know, fit your needs for that. So anyway, come down and see us. I'm Nate with Paradise RV. The man behind the camera is Carl. And we are open Monday through Friday, uh, 9 to 5. And we can meet after hours. And Saturday, 9 to 3. Uh, again, we can meet after hours for that too. Uh, but check out all of our inventory at RVParadise.com. And thanks for joining. Thank you. Have a good day, y'all. Hope to see y'all soon.